Hi friends, welcome to Joga Coaching. In this video, I will provide a detailed explanation about test driven development that is called TDD along with the examples and few advantages of using TDD in agile software development. Now let's understand what is test driven development. TDD is an agile software development technique. This emphasizes writing automated tests before writing the actual code. With this technique, the developers write the test for the feature or a function, then write the code that makes the test pass. TDD practice ensure that code is thoroughly tested, well designed and built incrementally. TDD encourages a cycle of rapid feedback, which helps to identify the problems early prevent defects and keep the code clean and maintainable. It's a core practice in many agile methodologies such as extreme programming. Let us understand about the TDD cycle now. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and click the bell icon to get notification about new videos. TDC is based on the short iterative cycle known as red green refactor cycle this cycle involves three steps and we can understand about those three cycles now the first step is red that is to write the failing tests the first step is to write the test for the new functionality we want to implement at this point the test will fail because the functionality does not exist yet the test case should focus on the smallest piece of functionality which we are trying to build. The second step is green, that is to make the test pass. Write the enough code to make the test pass. The goal is to not to implement the complete solution, but to implement the minimal functionality required to pass the test. This step step encourages writing simple, small, and focused code that only addresses the immediate test case. The third step is refactor, that is to clean the code. Once the test passes, review and refactor the code to improve its design and remove any duplication or inefficiency in the code. And this will ensure that all the tests still passes. Refactoring helps to maintain the clarity, simplicity, and quality of the code. After this cycle, the process repeat for the next piece of functionality. Now let us understand about the example of TDD code written in Python language to create a function that calculates the sum of two numbers in the calculator application. The step one, read, write a failing test. The first step is to write the fail case to add functions in add function in the python initially the add function does not exist so the test will fail if you see this code snippet we don't have any add functionality but the add functionality is called within this code snippet so this is the test case and we don't have the add function functional so it's failing so now let's get into the second step green here we will write the code to pass the test. In this case, we only need to implement the add function. So you can see the code definition add a comma b return a plus b. So this will return the result. This, with that, the test case will pass. The third step is refactor, clean up the code. In this example, the code is simple, so no refactoring is needed. However, in more complex scenarios, you might improve the code remove duplication or enhance the design without changing the behavior. After refactoring, the test should still pass. Hope you understood the process in detail now. Now let's learn about top five advantages of test driven development. The first advantage is improved code quality. Writing test first forces the developers to think about the software's behavior and design before the implementation. This leads to cleaner, more maintainable code 
that is easier to understand. The second advantage is refactoring with confidence. With a comprehensive suit of test in place, developer can confidently refactor and optimize the code, knowing that any issue introduced during the refactoring will be caught by the tests. The third advantage is better design and simplicity. TDD encourages developers to write a simple modular code that addresses specific needs. Since the code is driven by the test, it results in software design that are often simpler. The fourth advantage is early bug detection. Bugs are detected as soon as they are introduced because each piece of functionality is immediately tested after it's written. This leads to quicker feedback and fixes. The fifth advantage is continuous integration and deployment. TDD works well with continuous integration practices because tests are automated and can be run as part of the CI pipeline. This ensures that the software remains stable with each new integration. While TDD offers many advantages, it also presents some challenges. We can discuss about these challenges now. The first challenge is learning curve. Developers need to understand how to write effective tests and work with the TDD workflow. This can take time, especially for those who are new to the practice. The second disadvantage is initial development speed. Writing tests before coding can initially slow down the development process and it will take more time upfront. However, this is typically offset by the long term benefit of fewer bugs and faster bug fixes. A third disadvantage is test maintenance. As the code base evolves, tests must be maintained and updated or to reflect the changes. If tests are not kept to up to date, then these things will become obsolete or misleading. The fourth disadvantage is overhead. In some cases, TDD may lead to too much of test cases. This can make the testing process more time consuming. In summary, in the TDD, we will write failing test for a small piece of functionality and we will write the minimal code to make the test pass. After that, we will refactor the code to improve its design while keeping the test passing. After that, we will repeat these three steps in the cycle for each new function or features. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel to get notification about new videos. If you are looking for one-on-one -on -one coaching or training about Agile concept, career progress, please contact us through the email address mentioned in this slide. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video.